Hey Virgo, this is Kelly from House of Virgo. Welcome back to my channel. You guys, due to some time restraints over the weekend, I am going to do a little bit of a quickie love messages here for you based on the zodiac sign that you are connecting with. I've done this recently and I thought we would take a look at weekend energies, okay? Um, so if you're new to my channel, welcome. Please do hit like, share, and subscribe. Thank you everyone for supporting my channel. All right, let's get started with this reading, okay? So we're gonna take a look, Virgo, and I will attempt to put timestamps at the end of the reading. <clears throat> if you are connecting with an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, let's take a look and see what their weekend love messages are here towards you. Okay, it is safe for you to love, open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. So I feel like this air sign is starting to feel safe in a connection with you um, or beginning to feel like they can open up to you or express how they feel to you. So there may be um, some type of communication of some sort happening over the weekend um, where they feel safe and are feeling more comfortable about opening up how they feel about you. There you go. I want to tell you how I feel. So I do feel like there's an air sign over the weekend. Um, this is divine masculine energy who will be gearing up. It kind of feels like opening up to you to tell you how they feel about you over the weekend. Okay. They're, they're getting in that position. They're getting in that place. So you may get a call, you may get a phone call or a text message, or there may be some communication that starts, okay? So let's take a look at the Divine Masculine Water Sign, Cancer Scorpio Pisces. If you're dealing with a Divine Masculine Water Sign, Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Okay, retreat. So I feel like this person, either they've retreated from you or there's no communication, or they are thinking about disconnecting from the world and spending some time with you over the weekend, okay? Um, or thinking about how to go about and do that. Let's see. Okay, this person's starting to understand the connection between the both of you. So I kind of feel like this water sign... It's almost, it feels like, can we get together and, and try to talk, I feel, to get a better understanding, like alone time. This person wants alone time with you over the weekend, Virgo. Um, just you and they, nobody else, no public places, just the two of you taking a walk through a park, spending some time together, uh, communicating, um, retreating from the rest of the world. I feel like this person is coming to an understanding of what you mean to them and how important your connection is with them. Okay, so that's very good positive energy. So let's move on to the Divine Masculine Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, if you're connecting with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay, oh, engagement. There's commitment coming. This person is getting ready to... <laughs> They're either going to propose um, or tell you or communicate with you that they want to move things along to the next level, maybe become more exclusive. Okay, this person cannot stop thinking about you, Virgo. You are always on their mind, so much so that they want you forever. <laughs> so, I mean, these are pretty profound, Virgo. What's going on? <laughs> but some of you are like getting expressions of love, you're getting some time uh, alone with a partner, um, this person, another person is like constantly thinking about you and wanting to get into a more deeply committed relationship with you. Let's move on to fire sign, divine masculine energy, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, if you're connecting with a fire sign. Oh, this is your soulmate. They're coming to terms with that. I feel like this person is seeing that you are I don't even know. Yeah, I don't think it's, I think it's like twin flame that's kind of hard to understand for um, some people. But the soulmate, yes, totally. This person feels like you are their soulmate. Let's see what else. Okay, just being near you is intoxicating. Oh my gosh, Virgo. Wow, I know like some of you are like, does this person even realize that we're soulmates? Yes, this fire sign is coming to terms with that and seeing that you are the best fit. You are the only match. You are the only one for them. 
Virgo. Okay. So if you are a Virgo connecting with an air sign feminine, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, air sign feminine. Okay. All right. Virgo deception. Be careful. This person is false as F. Okay. This person is just, or they're thinking that you're fake. <laughs> one or the other but there's deception here someone here is wearing a false self mask okay oh i know i messed up everything oh virgo if you were connecting with an air sign this person was lying to you and those lies either they got caught or they like they're aware that they screwed something up here with you okay um this feels like karma i don't know if you're trying to talk to this person maybe you're not even communication with them but they 100% know that it's their fault. It's their lies, their false mask, whatever they were showing you. Some of you decided you didn't want anything to do with this person anymore. And now they're like, they know. They know it was their fault. They, institute, they instigated lies or deception. So, okay. And so that weekend energy is definitely playing out with this person. They couldn't get one over on you. Okay, so if you're connecting with a water sign feminine, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, water sign feminine. Okay, healing family issues, your love life benefits you forgive your parents. So this water sign feminine is really focusing on healing. They're doing a lot of healing energy, um, maybe working with crystals or counseling or therapy or Reiki or something. They're doing something. They, there's something coming up with this person where they understand that there was family problems or issues with parents, taking a look at that, um, maybe wanting to, uh, taking a look at your, uh, if you were had a family with this person, wanting to heal these problems. Okay, you guys are definitely in separation, so this person is feeling you, even though you're apart. I feel like the absence is waking somebody up, this water sign, to maybe uh, issues that they have with their parents in the past. Um, and how they projected that into your current relationship or um, you guys are in separation they want to heal this this your family connection could be external family members it could be if you are, were married or together or you had children together okay so that energy playing out over the weekend now if you are connecting with in an earth sign feminine virgo taurus capricorn earth sign feminine the over the weekend messages here are okay staying optimistic about this connection and the love between the two of you um, this earth sign is staying very positive about you okay not giving up they don't want to give up on this connection with you but they do regret lying to you they they oh I oh oh okay they're just telling me they're saying um, they're staying positive and hoping that you will forgive them for any lies that they may have told to you in the past. Okay. I don't feel, you know what? I don't, Virgo, I don't feel like this earth sign uh, feminine is trying to um, have something be over here with you. You might, maybe you do, maybe you want it to be over, but maybe you don't. But either way, I feel like this person is, she doesn't want to give up and she hopes you won't give up either. Okay, that's really what's coming towards me here. You might get some communication. Um, so, uh, you know what, you guys, I'm going to tell you right now, I do feel like you're going to get communication from your person over the weekend. Okay, everything that I said for each individual sign in white, that's a communication that you're going to get. Let's see this fire sign. If you're dealing with a fire feminine, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Okay, reconciliation. So this person's coming back into your life or wants to heal this connection. Um, they want to reconcile with you, make things right with you. And they're going to tell you that they love you. Okay, so the fire sign female is going to tell you that they love you. The earth sign female is going to tell you that they regret lying to you. The 
water sign feminine is going to tell you that even though you guys haven't been talking, they miss you. The air sign feminine is going to tell you that they know it was their fault and that they, they messed everything up. The fire sign masculine is going to tell you that every time they're with you, um, their eyes glaze over like a really good donut, a really yummy donut. You know, like a glazed donut that didn't come out very well. The earth sign masculine is going to tell you that they can't stop thinking about you. The water sign masculine is going to tell you that they're starting to understand things about your connection that they didn't see or understand before. And the air sign masculine is going to tell you that they want to tell you how they feel about you. Okay, so this was a quickie. This was short. Leave comments. Let me know after the weekend passes if any of this energy played out for you. And again, if you want to get a personal reading, there's a link in the description box below. Please hit like, share, and subscribe. I know it was short and sweet, but that's about all I can do right now. So I'll see you guys later. Have a wonderful weekend. Take care.